Hey, I'm Daniel with Sherwood Tiny, and I just want to show you this awesome tiny house we have named Shalon. So let me uh, show you around. So we put a lot of work and creativity into the little details of this exterior of this house, and uh, it really turned out great. I love it. So we've got several different styles of siding here. We've got the, the lapboard hardy plank. And then over there, we've got the hardy um, board and batten. And then we've got the cedar lapboard siding around the door there. And then the cedar shake up there in the gables. And then as you see, we've got the, um, the copper penny standing seam metal roof, which just looks really sharp. So, and then right around here on the end, Here's the end of the house, and we have this trailer is built on a hefty car hauler trailer with 10,000 pound axle. Here we get the side of the house. This is the kitchen window. And then over here, we have, on this end, the back of the house, we have the water inlet and the uh, AC unit built in into the loft up there. And this here is our utility closet with our tankless propane water heater, and a little bit of storage space in here, and the electric panel. And also, as you can see, we did spray foam in this house, so it is very well insulated. Okay, let's go inside. I wanna show you around. So, we have a French door coming into this house, so you can go ahead and just open this thing up, maybe put a big old porch there and just invite the outside in on this tiny house here. In the kitchen, we have this beautiful blue, dark blue. I love this backsplash. It looks so cool in here with the two burner cooktop induction, the single bowl sink with this big fancy faucet. Then there is a 10 cubic foot refrigerator, 24 inch wide with a freezer. I have the cabinets here underneath with just with shelving and the floating shelving over there. And then take a look at this. I just love this pendant, so classy. So over here, we've got the bar, the bar stools. And then here by the door, there's a little closet area with space for hanging and a washing machine with shelving. Then this house is meant to be heated with an electric heater, so we, have a electric fireplace here as an example because really this house it doesn't take hardly anything to heat this thing so with a good infrared heater it can be super efficient and look cool so then we've got the loft up there and i will just show you up there real quick up this ladder So it's got space up here for a queen size or a full size bed and then in any kind of built in shelving or shelving units, whatever you want to put in here. I like to leave the loft open for creativity. And as you see, it's kind of cool. We've got this is a rounded ceiling here. And then over here, we've got these cedar beams. Okay, now I'm going to show you the bathroom and look there's me hey here we go we got the this vanity here with the with the vessel sink and a shiplap wall as an accent on the back here and just to get a load of the ceiling I just love how this turned out here leading into the uh kitchen all right then we got this beautiful gray stone tile shower and then this is pretty cool 
the light and mirror. Ding! And, um, yep, nice window in here, some gray tile floor. And over here we have the hardwood, engineered hardwood flooring in here. So here's a perspective of the living room. So I hope you enjoyed this tour of Shalon. If you have any questions or you're interested in buying this tiny house or even having us build you a custom tiny house, please just let us know. Thanks.